my advice for each one of the characters in the movie would be first to learn to love yourself. Because when you first learn to love yourself, or when you learn to love yourself, I think you're wiser, pay more attention to detail, but you're able to love again. But when you don't love yourself, you really can't really love. You you give parts of you, but you don't truly give all of you. And um, when you love yourself, there are certain things that because you love yourself, you just won't let certain things come in. And I think with each one of the characters, I think they were lacking that self-love in some aspect. And one of the characters, the one that had, each one of them had some tragedy um, that led them to the point in which they were. And I think with each one of them, they really needed counseling. Counseling is one of those things that a lot of times it was frowned upon. <laughs> mm -hmm. But if you go to someone who can counsel you and not be judgmental, and that means sometimes you can't go to a friend, but go to someone who's professional in what they do and is able to counsel you and walk you through the steps. And I think each one of the characters needed that as well. Just some some form of counseling in their life to help them to get over that past. Because a lot of times we hold so deeply or we hold on to the past so much that we can't let go and we can't move forward. And as long as you hold on the past and you're looking at the past, you're looking back at the past, you'll never be able to look ahead at the future because you constantly allow that to hold over your head.